Hello students, how are you all? I hope all of you are very fine at your home. In the last video, we started the chapter uh, 10, time. And in the last video, we did these type of questions where the minute hand is on 12, on 6 and on 3 and 9. Okay. Now, this time we are going to do when the minute hand is on other positions. Okay. Before doing that, let us see the clock time in hours and minutes when the minute hand moves from one number to the next number it takes five minutes see children in the last video also i told you that we there are five small divisions in between each number see between 12 and 1 there will be five so we have five minutes so between two numbers we have Gap of 5 minutes means a minute hand takes 5 minutes to reach from one number to the next number. So here they have shown all the uh, minutes in the clock. Like when the minute hand is on 1 it will be 5 minutes. When it is on 2 it will be 10. When on 3 it is 15. Then 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55 and lastly 60 minutes. We are not writing actually 60 minutes, but I will tell you how will you do. Okay, now we have all these minutes which you have to remember. And simply you can remember that whenever the hand is on a particular position, we have to multiply that with 5 only. Okay, like if it is on 2 I say, then we have to multiply 2 with 5. It will be 5 2 is a 10. Okay, when it is on 6, then 6 5 is a 30. Like this you have to do. Now, let us read on the clock face. Shown on the right hand, the hour hand is between 4 and 5 and the minute hand is at 10. Now, how will you read? See, it is on about to reach 5 it is. So, it will be 4. Then on 10 it is. So, 10 fives are 50. So, 4, 50 will be the answer. So, here also they have given the same explanation. 10 multiplied by 5 is equal to 50 minutes. How 50 came? We have multiplied 10 with 5. It will be 50. Now, telling time to the exact minute. There are 5 small divisions between 2 consecutive numbers on the dial. Okay. See, the di this is the dial. Okay. Here, between 1 and 12, we have 5 di divisions. Now, look at this clock face. You will see dots between the numbers. These dots show minutes. On the clock face, shown on the right, the minute hand is between 6 and 7. It is two small divisions ahead of number 6. It shows that it has moved 30 plus 2. Means 30 is already over, but it is two divisions after this. So we have to count those two also. And those two divisions will be 2 minutes. Then it will be 30 plus 2. It will be 32 minutes. So, the time is 4.32. Now, we have some questions related to that. Exercise 10.1. See, observe the clock carefully and uh, fill in the blanks. So, we have to observe the clock. Clock is not actually given here. But we have to see this. The question we have to see and write the answer. The hour hand takes dash hours to move from 1 to 3. See, children. When the hour hand moves from 1 to 3, how many hours will it take? See, we can find out the difference. 1 to 3, we have to go. So, from 1 to 2, it will take 1 hour. Then, from 2 to 3, it will take 1 hour. So, it will be 2 hours. See, 1 to 3, you can subtract also. 3 minus 1 is equal to 2. So, 2 hours will be the answer. So, you have to write 2. The minute hand takes dash minutes now you have to see that he when it is written hour hand or when it is written minute hand the minute hand takes dash minutes to move from 1 to 3 so again we have 3 minus 1 is equal to 2 but the difference is we have to multiply with 5 it will be 10 okay so 10 minutes will be your answer now c part the minute hand takes dash minutes to move from 2 to 4 here also 4 minus 2, 2 but multiply with 5. Okay, 
then it will be 10 okay so here we have to write 10 now our hand takes dash, uh, dash r's to move from 2 to 4 again it will be 4 minus 2 2 so this way you have to do all these questions i hope you understood this topic question number 2 is how many minutes in each of these slices think in groups of 5 minutes each to get your answer quickly now we have a uh, dial or we have we can say that a part of the dial we have given with and we have to find out that how many minutes the minute hand will take to cover this here in a part we have from 12 to 3 so first of all we have to see how many numbers it is covering so from here to here it is 5 here 5 here 5 3 parts are there 5 plus 5 plus 5 also we can do or we can say 3 multiply by 5 so answer will be 15 minutes then we have b part from 11 to 1 11 to 12 it will be 1 5 then here again 5 5 plus 5 10 minutes okay C, D and E part you have to do yourself.